Adorama TV presents Getting the Shot with Corey Rich. I'm Corey Rich and you're watching Adorama TV. Adorama is the place that I buy everything photo and video related that I need to make compelling content. In this episode of Exploring the Creative Process, we're really talking about capturing in-between moments. Now, in any sporting event, whether that's football, baseball, basketball, heck, even shooting a wedding, we're so focused on shooting that peak action, that one pinnacle moment. It's the tackle. It's the hitting the ball. It's the sliding into the base. But a ton of beautiful, incredible storytelling moments take place before and after in between those peak action moments. And that's what this episode is really about. Several years ago, I had the opportunity to travel to Europe and work with professional rock climber and Red Bull athlete David Lama. Now, I've told some stories and talked about David in past Adorama video spots, but on this particular occasion, we were actually very close to his home in Innsbruck, Austria. Of course, my main goal was to make beautiful photographs of David doing what he does best as a professional climber, which is rock climbing, those peak action moments. So the peak action takes place from, from the belay point, the hanging point. He climbs 165 feet roughly and then gets to another belay stance. And at the belay stances, we spend a lot of time. It's when you're looking at the next pitch, you're trying to decide if you're hungry, you're drinking water, you're adjusting your equipment on the side of your harness. And oftentimes, those moments go ignored. Now, at this particular cliff, I noticed that there was fantastic light and fantastic compositional op opportunities. There were spines of rock in the background and backlight that was pouring through the clouds. Every once in a while, there were fleeting moments. It wasn't continuous lighting. So in this situation, as soon as the sun came out, I actually switched into aperture priority. I knew that I wanted to be at f4. I wanted a shallow depth of field and a fast enough shutter speed. And so the camera did a wonderful job of actually determining the shutter speed. I'm at 200 ISO, f4, aperture priority, and the camera decided 1250th of a second. It was perfect backlit exposure, and it made for a pretty darn cool photograph. When I'm hanging at a belay right next to the climber, it's pretty tight quarters, and so I'm on a lightweight camera. I want to move quickly through the mountains. I want as little weight hanging off me as possible, so I'm a D800, and today that would be a D810. Additionally, I'm using a 14 to 24 Nikkor lens, and the 14 millimeter, I, I love that I'm right on top of David, but it feels like I'm actually 10 or 15 feet away when the reality is I'm, I'm just literally five feet from David pushing against the anchor with my feet slipping out from under me, trying to just get elevated slightly so that I can create that higher perspective and really capture those fins of rock in the valley in the background. And of course, this, the moment really is when David looks up had he been looking down and we just saw his Red Bull helmet or the back of his hood, that just wouldn't do the job for us. It's that, that subtlety of he looks up and all of a sudden we get a little catch light in his eyes. He's looking up at the what's ahead. It makes you ask a question as the viewer, like what's he about to do? If you take one thing away from this exploring the creative process, I hope it's it's not just about the peak action. And this applies to mainstream sports. It applies to weddings. It's not just the kiss. It's those quiet moments at the wedding when they're, they're away from the crowd. At the football game, it's not just about the hard hits and the tackles. It's about what happens on the sidelines or the before and after the game. It's in the locker room. And that's exactly what I did here with David Lama. It's not just about the rock climbing, the peak action, pulling on the small holds. It's about finding those in-between moments and really leveraging light composition and moment. I'm Corey Rich. You're watching Adorama TV. And uh, there's tons of free content just like this getting published on a regular basis. So if you don't follow us on our YouTube channel, please do. And I'll see you soon. Thanks for listening. Be sure to check out Adorama's latest contest. You can win all kinds of cool stuff. Do you want great looking prints at low cost? Be sure to visit our easy to use online printing service. 
Adorama Pix has professionals who treat your images with the utmost care that you can count on. For a quick turnaround on photos, cards, or albums, use AdoramaPix.com.